guys where are we we are in Kosovo and guess what this is guys we found some goulash and I think some muskri it's called some it, insane big some bread. bread he said that's a traditional very nice Kosovan dish so we are here in Kosovo in Pristina and now we're eating something very nice and today we're gonna eat even more we're gonna try everything they have here in Pristina we want to eat some real Kosovan food and see what we can find so let's give this a try Nick what do you say <laughs> wow it's so good it's like German goulash I have to say really good taste and with the bread I think it's really authentic so guys let's enjoy this and I don't know what this is is this with potato huh? I think with some rice with potato with some beans so guys if you know exactly what it is you can write it in the comments guys mm. I think lentils also let's enjoy this guys guys everything finished three portions down the drain wow, guys I have to say at first I thought like hmm, let's try what nice food is this here in Kosovo look at this how we finished the plate clean everything finish finish done done the taste was incredible the price is also really affordable it's like 250 250 for one gulash it's really good I'm hyped for a try more Kosovo food and maybe some desert and uh, drink later a coffee yeah but the first impression of Christina is really nice really modern city they have a nice city center and uh, yeah let's see what else you can find and guys let's find some local restaurants guys after the massive meal we need a little digester guys always the espresso after the meal and i have to say i quite like it here all over the balkan so far they always had nice uh, coffee and everybody drinks espresso they have no cappuccino here but always espresso sometimes espresso was even like 50 cent 60 cent yeah it's here, amazing in here also it's 60 cent so that's nice guys in germany when you want the espresso one to two euro minimum so that's very nice mm -hmm. tomorrow we also drank a coffee that was nice and eat some bakery stuff where they have a lot of pastry here and we also paid like only 1 euro 70 for two chocolate croissants and these things with sausages very nice so and they also love the german cars guys all over the balkan not just albania here's even crazier i think in kosovo and i think kosovo they have a little bit more money i think so because like insane buildings and all that stuff so guys really check it out if you have the chance to come here for food vacation if you want to because the food is actually crazy boy guys we landed in in a nice coffee and guys what a service really nice so far i have to say the kosovo people also like the albanians and like north macedonian people they treated us so nice they're always so interested where we come from i think they have not so many tourists here so guys look at what we got here i got some sucuk baguette it looks delicious real oh, looks so tasty sucuk for those who know i love sucuk and uh, with, with a nice baguette the the bakery quality here is also really good so we as germans we also know what good bread has to look like and i have to say so far this is the country where they do the best bakery quality so guys we also have some sort of cinnamon chocolate um, roll, roll canana roll and Noah has the same and also some little buns cheese cheese, cheese cream cheese bun and the best thing about it guys look at this one here 350 for all of that with two espressos two water two chocolate sucuk everything so guys insane insane like, price insane quality let's bite into it and see how it tastes laughing guys damn really good yes i think guys we're only here two days in kosovo but i will gain some weights here because the food is amazing so guys if you come here focus on the food so far i can tell you that and also the coffee is really good and for the price what can i say three euro fifty i think that's one of the cheapest things uh, for the best quality we ever got so guys enjoy and we hit you up if we sign find something new or later taste something for dinner something different but let's see what we can find and what else we can do in the city guys 
we made it down the hill and towards the center because we need to grab something more guys it was only a little appetizer so now we need to grab some more food and look at what we found on the way here i think this is the main library of Pristina, and i have to say architecture wise interesting a little brutalist and now we're heading on and just a little thing we wanted to tell you guys we went to the balkan with no expectations and we came here and i have to say guys Balkan's amazing the food is nice people are very friendly so definitely worth to checking out and hopefully we can get some more köfte or something so oh, man i'm so hungry <laughs> let's get some nice food wow guys i know i did say we we're gonna get go for dinner and some real food but guys we couldn't stop we had another bakery <laughs> really nice bakery and I think also really local one because yeah. Noah got the national dish here in Kosovo. I don't think it's a national dish, but she, she suggested it. She said it's very typical. She said it's traditional food. Yeah, typical, but not national dish, man. So I think it's called flea. It looks like a lot of steak pancakes. It has uh, many berries to it. So let's try it. it looks good, but it looks a little bit like put together waffles or pancake. Pancake, but it's salty. But it's salty. Quite Really awesome, I have to try it man. Let's give it a go. Oh, oh this is hard to eat man. Help me. Mmm. <laughs> mm, it's really salty. Wow. I thought it's sweet. Okay, next to that guys, you know I'm a big baklava fan. I got a baklava. So let's go also try this. It's the same like in Macedonia we had one with nuts, hazelnut. Baklava never disappoints. And on top of that, I never saw it guys. We have some sticks with white chocolate and with dark chocolate and some sesame. Really nice. I like the texture of this and the combination of the dry uh, bread stick uh, with the chocolate. So you see guys, pastry in those countries are amazing. So, we're gonna finish up that and then we're gonna go for dinner. Guys, look what just arrived. Oh, those beautiful chirapchi. Noah, the last ones. Last the last cheese. Kosovan meal, guys. But it's it looks really good, I have to say. The bread, as always, like all the bread in all the Balkans, I have to say, the pastry, the baking, everything here is incredible. Also, the normal main dishes. The meat is good. The ayva is good. I like the ayva, it's my favorite. And, and the yeah, goulash no. was also very good, guys. <laughs> so, I really have to say, Balkans, shout out to your food culture. All three countries we were amazing food guys so yes. definitely we have to come back because we only had a short trip here guys as you know and we also had like four days of rain we were in north albania we wanted to film some videos for you guys but two days pure rain and also here our first day only rain but now the last two days in Pristina, we had some nice time nice food guys let's enjoy our last köfte yes let's enjoy this guys and greeting to all our albanian uh, and Balkan people who are watching um, I hope you like it we will come back for sure and yes be also hyped for the next adventure the next videos are gonna be insane we have some nice plans so guys be hyped for that and yeah